Have you ever gazed up at the night sky and wondered if someone or something might be gazing back? From the earliest cave drawings to the sophisticated radio telescopes scanning the cosmos today, humanity's fascination with the stars has been a constant companion through the ages. This longing to connect with the cosmos raises the age-old question. Are we alone in the universe? The concept of extraterrestrial civilizations is not just a staple of science fiction, but a serious scientific inquiry. As we stand in the year 2024, the journey to understand if life exists beyond our blue planet has never been more compelling. We're on the cusp of new discoveries with technologies that stretch our senses beyond the visible, reaching into the depths of the universe where light from the earliest galaxies still travels toward us. Join us as we delve into the milestones that have shaped our understanding of life beyond Earth. The quest began long before the first telescope pointed towards the heavens. In the tapestry of human curiosity, the idea of life beyond our Earth has been a persistent thread. Ancient civilizations, from the Greeks to the Chinese, pondered the existence of other worlds akin to our own. Philosophers like Epicurus proposed the universe was infinite, teeming with planets harboring life. As centuries turned, the intellectual baton passed to the luminaries of the Enlightenment. The telescope, a fledgling invention of the time, offered the first real gateway to the stars. Yet it was not until the 20th century that our quest took a more scientific shape. The establishment of the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence, or SETI, marked a pivotal chapter in this cosmic detective story. SETI's early days were marked by ambitious projects equipped with rudimentary tools. Radio telescopes, those giant ears tuned to the cosmos, listened intently for whispers from the depths of space. The project's genesis can be traced back to the pioneering work of Frank Drake and his famed Drake Equation, which sought to estimate the number of communicable civilizations in the Milky Way. This equation, a beacon in the dark, guided the early methodologies of SETI. As technology advanced, so did our methods, paving the way for groundbreaking discoveries. In 2015, humanity's ears widened with the advent of the Breakthrough Listen project. In an era where the cosmos was largely silent, this ambitious initiative, funded by tech magnate Yuri Milner, heralded a new chapter in the quest to detect extraterrestrial life. With an astounding commitment of $100 million, Breakthrough Listen wasn't just a step forward, it was a giant leap. The project's primary arsenal included some of the Earth's most powerful telescopes. The Green Bank Telescope in West Virginia, the Parkes Observatory in Australia, and the Automated Planet Finder at Lick Observatory in California each played pivotal roles. These technological behemoths were not just scanning the sky, they were meticulously sifting through cosmic whispers across billions of frequency channels. But what exactly were they searching for? The project targeted a variety of signals, anything that could suggest technological activity from civilizations light years away. These could be radio signals or even laser emissions across wide swathes of the universe. The strategy was straightforward, listen broadly and listen smartly, using algorithms sophisticated enough to differentiate between a potential alien signal and the cosmic background noise. As the data poured in, it was analysed with unprecedented depth. Teams of scientists and AI systems worked in tandem to scrutinise every blip and bleep captured by the telescopes. Interestingly, the data, now in the exabytes, was also made available to the public. This open approach not only democratised the search for extraterrestrial intelligence but also galvanised a global community of amateur astronomers and curious minds. Despite the vastness of this endeavour, the results were humbling. The universe, it appeared, was not eager to divulge its secrets. The expected flurry of signals did not materialise, instead the cosmos retained its enigmatic silence. But this silence was not absolute. Occasionally anomalies surfaced, unusual signals that defied immediate explanation, teasing the imaginations of scientists and enthusiasts alike. Yet as our capabilities expanded, the silence from the cosmos became more profound, but not without anomalies. Not all signals conform to expectations. In the pursuit of understanding the cosmos, certain anomalies have stood out. 
whispering the tantalizing possibility of extraterrestrial civilizations. Take, for example, the WOW signal. Detected in 1977, this 72-second burst of radio waves appeared to come from somewhere in the constellation Sagittarius. Its origin remains unexplained, fueling ongoing speculation and excitement. Fast forward to more recent years, and the interstellar object Oumuamua has equally baffled scientists. Discovered in 2017, this object exhibited unusual acceleration and an unexpected shape, unlike any comet or asteroid known to us. Its behavior and properties led some to speculate about its artificial origins, perhaps an alien probe sent to observe our solar system. While these instances are compelling, they also highlight the complexities of space exploration. Each unexplained signal or anomalous object forces us to question our understanding of the universe. Could these be mere quirks of cosmic phenomena, or are they evidence of intelligent life beyond Earth? The debate is ongoing, and each new discovery adds layers to our understanding. Scientists continue to analyze data, refine techniques, and look deeper into the cosmos, hoping to find definitive answers. These peculiar findings keep the hope alive and scientists guessing. What if extraterrestrial life doesn't just send signals, but also manipulates its environment? Imagine cosmic architects capable of reshaping stars and galaxies into tools and habitats. This isn't science fiction, it's a genuine thread in the tapestry of astrobiology and theoretical physics. Let's delve into the concept of astroengineering, a field that posits advanced civilizations might construct megastructures around stars to harness their energy. The most famous of these is the Dyson Sphere, a theoretical construct that completely envelops a star to capture most or all of its energy output. If such a structure existed, it would not only signify an advanced technological prowess, but also a civilization thinking on galactic scales. But why search for such grand constructions? These could serve as beacons, alerting us to the presence of advanced extraterrestrial civilizations. The search for extraterrestrial intelligence, or SETI, has begun to consider these possibilities in their scans of the cosmos. Each star, cloaked in inexplicable darkness or with unusual light fluctuations, could be a candidate for such astro-engineering. Now, let's touch upon the broader implications of these ideas. The Fermi paradox poses a simple question. If the universe is so vast and potentially so populated, why haven't we encountered definitive proof of other civilizations? Here is where the concept of the Great Filter comes in. This hypothesis suggests there are stages in the evolutionary process that are extremely hard to pass. Could the construction of something as complex as a Dyson Sphere be one of these filters? Could it be that civilizations reach a certain level of technological sophistication only to face insurmountable obstacles? These questions are not just about them, they are about us. What stages of the Great Filter might humanity already have passed, and what challenges lie ahead? Could our quest to find extraterrestrial life inadvertently reveal the limits of our own survival? The universe may be teeming with life, yet its silence could speak volumes about our own future. As of 2024, our quest has morphed from mere listening to understanding the silence. In this pivotal year, the fabric of our understanding about extraterrestrial civilizations has been enriched not just by technological advancements, but by a profound shift in our approach. We've transitioned from the passive receipt of potential signals to actively probing the cosmos in ways previously consigned to the realms of science fiction. Let's delve into the technological forefronts that have defined this era. The integration of AI and machine learning into our telescopes and probes has revolutionized the way we search for signals and interpret data. These tools have not only increased the speed of data analysis, but have also allowed us to detect anomalies that were previously overlooked. The James Webb Space Telescope, now fully operational, has peered into the atmospheres of distant exoplanets, searching for signs of biosignatures like methane and oxygen that could hint at life. Moreover, the Mars Sample Return Mission, a collaborative effort spearheaded by multiple space agencies, is set to bring back samples from the Martian surface. These samples, potentially holding fossilized evidence of past life, are expected to arrive by the end of this year. 
Concurrently, the Europa Clipper is gearing up to survey Jupiter's moon Europa, with its subsurface ocean considered one of the most promising places to find life in our solar system. On the theoretical front, astrobiologists and physicists have proposed new models for understanding life in extreme environments. This not only broadens our criteria for habitable zones, but also enhances our interpretations of data from telescopes scanning distant galaxies. Collaborative international efforts have also seen a significant uptick. The establishment of the Unified Space Life Forms Research Facility, a joint venture between countries, underscores a global commitment to the search for extraterrestrial intelligence. This facility pools the world's best technologies and minds to tackle the monumental task of understanding life beyond Earth. The journey continues, with each discovery a piece of the cosmic puzzle, drawing us ever closer to answering the eternal question of whether we are alone in the universe.